Yo guys, it's Punk, and I want to talk to you guys about who I think will be the next EX for the 4th anniversary and why. So I want to point out that I've been wrong before. I was wrong about the 2nd anniversary. I thought um, Kaido would drop after Odin because Kaido had been leaked. And then when he didn't drop, I thought he would I thought he would drop for the 2.5 anniversary, which he also didn't. Um, but one thing that's undeniable is that Bondi always does a pair for the anniversary and it's always two people that pair well together and are and are from the same arc um for example first anniversary um it was blackbeard and shanks and that makes total sense because both are like sworn enemies and they both show up towards the end of the paramount war you know uh blackbeard gave shanks his scar all that it makes sense and then the second anniversary was odin and roger it wasn't odin and kaido like i thought it would be and wanted it to be but it still makes total sense because of the flashbacks and Odin's backstory, you know, how he joined Roger's crew and all that. And then third anniversary was Yamato and Kaido. And that makes perfect sense too. It, you know, a son who's rebelling against his father and it's, and it's the same arc. And of course, you know, and of course after Kaido, they dropped Luffy who pairs, what, who pairs very well with Kaido, obviously, but it wasn't, it's not Wano Luffy. You know, so te technically the pair is Yamato and Kaido, and Luffy was like a surprise EX. Bandai wanted us to think it was over after Kaido, you know, and they surprised us with Luffy. So, for the fourth anniversary, we've got Wano Big Mom, and unlike before, I'm not gonna say it's for sure gonna be one character, but I will tell you this, there are only two characters that can pair well with Big Mom, Wano Big Mom, and that's Hybrid Kaido, and tag team kid in law not raid zoro not and you know and not hybrid yamato there's there's no real chemistry between either of those two and big mom like there's nothing there um kaido yeah kaido is the big bad that she is allied with for this arc and kid in law are the ones that are fighting big mom right now and i don't want to spoil it for people who only watch the anime but trust me if you were a manga reader, you would understand why Kid and Law are the only other good pair with her. And I say tag team Kid and Law because Bandai wouldn't give the glory to just one of them, and also because the anime is not where it needs to be for them to be separate EXs. And that's all I'll say. That's all I'll say about that part. Um, but I think Bandai wants to do the whole three EX deal again, and Blackbeard has been leaked for a very long time. So I can see him being the, the third surprise EX, but in this case, I see hybrid Kaido being the better choice for the second EX because if Blackbeard was to be the third EX, like EX Luffy, he wouldn't, he wouldn't be a Wano character, but he would still have something to pair him with Big Mom and Kaido, and that would be his Yonko status, you know? So yeah, those are my thoughts on who's coming next. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know in the comments what you think, if you agree or disagree, all that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.